The AMX-10 RC Renov, or AMX-10 RCR, is a French reconnaissance and fire support vehicle. It is an upgraded version of the AMX-10 RC that was adopted by the French Army back in 1979. A total of 284 original AMX-10 RC vehicles were delivered to the French Army. Between 2005 and 2010 a total of 256 vehicles were upgraded to the AMX-10 RCR standard in order to keep them operational until 2015 to 2020. In the near future the AMX-10 RCR vehicles are due to be replaced by a new Jaguar reconnaissance and combat vehicle. French Army has a requirement for up to 250 new machines. Deliveries of the Jaguar are scheduled to begin in 2020. Upgrades includes add-on armor kit for a higher level of protection, Gaelic self-protection system and Lyrae infrared jamming system. Upgraded AMX-10 RCR tank destroyers are also fitted with a battlefield management information system and identification friend or foe system. Automotive system upgrades include new automatic transmission and new suspension control system. However, upgraded vehicles lost their amphibious capability. The AMX-10 RCR has seen service during various military conflicts. The main role of this vehicle is reconnaissance and fire support of friendly units. It can also escort convoys, patrol, and perform territorial defense tasks. It is also capable of rapid intervention. The AMX-10 RCR can engage armored vehicles, buildings, field fortifications, and other targets. The original AMX-10 RC was even called a tank destroyer. However, this vehicle is not normally used to engage tanks. Even though it can penetrate front armor of the older tanks, such as T-55 and T-62, modern main battle tanks would be a tough nut for this vehicle. Vehicle is armed with a giant F-2 105mm rifled gun. It fires APFSDS, heat, heat and smoke rounds. The range of effective fire is over 2,000 meters. A total of 38 rounds are carried for the gun. The AMX-10 RC has a coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. After the upgrade another 7.62mm roof-mounted machine gun was added. The AMX-10 RCR can open fire just after 10 seconds when the target is spotted. Vehicle has a high first round hit rate. However it can fire the main gun accurately only when stationary, as the gun is not stabilized. Vehicle has got a panoramic commander's sight. It seems that it provides this vehicle a hunter-killer engagement capability, which is present on most modern main battle tanks and fire support vehicles. Upgraded AMX-10 RCR fire support vehicles are also fitted with a battlefield management information system and identification friend or foe system. Hull and turret are of welded aluminum armor construction. Upgraded vehicles were fitted with add-on armor kit for a higher level of protection. Vehicle withstands hits from medium-caliber weapons and artillery shell splinters. Cage armor can be fitted for protection against anti-tank rockets, such as RPGs. Upgraded AMX-10 RCR vehicles were also fitted with Gaelic self-protection system and Lyrae infrared jamming system. Vehicle also has an NBC protection system. Vehicle is operated by a crew of four, including commander, gunner, loader and driver. This fire support vehicle is based on a purpose-designed 6x6 wheel chassis. It uses a number of automotive components of the AMX 10P infantry fighting vehicle. Automotive system upgrades include new automatic transmission instead of the manual one. It is possible that the old 280 horsepower engine was also replaced by a modern unit. Vehicle has a hydropneumatic suspension with adjustable ground clearance. The ground clearance can be adjusted from 0.6 to 0.2 m. Furthermore the vehicle can sit, stand, kneel or lean in any direction. Upgraded AMX-10 RCRs have a new suspension control system. Vehicle is also fitted with a central tire pressure system, which improves mobility over difficult terrain. Vehicle can continue to move when one or two tires are totally destroyed. However, upgraded vehicles lost their amphibious capability. The rear sprinkler and front breakwater were removed. 